this is hydrogen tap. What we're doing here now is an experiment to show us, to give us some more insight to what's going on with the hydrogen. Watch very carefully here. What we're going to do is watch this. Or that's what I'm going to do. Close as we can possibly get to it. This is hydrogen being made. Those are wires you're seeing that's wrapped around a piece of stainless steel. This is a sidebar to the number one video I made wrapping a stainless steel rod with a wire. This is doing the same thing, only I've wrapped the wire around flat stainless steel. In number one video, the stainless steel is around. And what we're trying to see here, or what I'm trying to see here, is what goes on. This is 0 0.40 amps, not quite a half an amp. And now I'm going to change that over. We're going to see what happens. That's at 12 volts. We change this over to 24 volts. A good look at that over here. give us some insight to what's going on. The negative is the plate itself. That's what you're seeing everything come off of. The positive is the wire that's wrapped around it. Well, let's try 36 volts. Running this at 1.80 amps, 36 volts. Take a good look at that if you want. That's your amp reading. Okay, we're running at 36 volts, about 1.80 amps. I'm 
I don't quite know what I expect to see here, but might run into something you never know. One thing you should notice is that the water is a kind of a cloudy, but it's nothing like the cell that I had in there before or the Widowmaker. I was getting ready to put another cell in there when suddenly I looked to see what was on the top. And you can see for yourself. This is distilled water, and this is what comes from putting straight wire in there. That's from the wire or the tin.